All right, guys, so GTA 6 trailer is finally here, and oh my god, it is everything personally that I wanted to see in a GTA 6 trailer that I didn't expect, and it just blew my mind, man. We're going to we're gonna get into a full breakdown, things you may have missed, so much more in this video, so if you guys want to stay tuned for more videos like this, live streams, and so much more, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel, drop this video a like so more people can see it, and all that good stuff, man. So let's get into it, man. Real quick, man, just a little recap of the whole trailer. Uh, in my opinion, it's, like I said, everything, in my opinion, that probably every fan ever dreamed of for a video game for GTA 6 trailer. The, the amount of detail that we're going to get into, I'll talk about in this game. For certain things throughout the trailer, you guys, we, we all seen by now, it is just insane. Uh, you know, it could have been better, in my opinion. I feel like, and unfortunately, the trailer, I mean, I guess some people don't mind. But like, it was came a little bit earlier than it was supposed to. But thankfully, he didn't mess up the release of it and rock and the hype because someone apparently leaked it. And then that's why Rockstar had to, you know, release it when they did. But yeah, anyways, man, I love the whole the Lucia and the Bonnie and Clyde type theme to it and all that is just incredible, man. The scenery, everything, outstanding. So we're gonna go through the entire trailer like i said go through every little detail that you guys may have missed and let's talk about it man also by the way i have a live reaction i did if you guys want to see my live raw reaction when it first dropped i literally watched it on stream like for the first time i'll leave that link so if you guys want to go check that out okay so first things first man when the trailer first starts you get that classic you know rock star like show in the city you know and the amount of detail you can already see in this one picture you know this one you know the very beginning the traffic you know, you can see like the the way the weather is. It's more you get the little you get the little smog kind of in the air. It looks like the sun may be setting, and the, you see the plane going by up in the sky, and just the overall detail from the distance, from the water, the reflections already off the very beginning of the rip. You can tell that this is a masterpiece. So next up, we get to see the, one of the main protagonists. There's two of them. There is Jason and there is Lucia. Now it looks like she's in prison. It shows like her in prison, it shows like the prison yard. Uh, then it goes to her sitting down speaking with somebody. And then the person speaking with her asks Lucia, do you know why you're here? And she says, it's bad luck, I guess. And let me just say, man, Lucia looks, ooh, yo, she looks, she looks good, man. And then this is where the trailer, this is when it all hits you. And just like, you're just like, oh my God, this is, this happened, this it. You see Rockstar, yeah, Rockstar Games present it shows the ocean you see the people on the beach and you see vice city dude it's just like the city skyline they're right there all by the beach you see the plane going by uh we'll get into in a second what it says but this is just mind-blowing like stunning like when i seen it like my live reaction like even looking at it right now while i'm editing this video it's just like oh my god like it, it couldn't be any better like, this is it dude. Like, this is so wild it looks amazing let's talk about a few things in this before we go continue on further into the trailer so if you guys kind of notice in the water there's already dolphins there's there is a shark as well you can see there and on the beach you can see it's way more populated the beach is way more bigger you could tell than the beach we have in gta 5 you could already tell just right off rip the map in in general is just gonna be it looks massive you can already tell by the beach like the you know the amount of people that are there compared to gta 5 just looks amazing and then you continue on to the city skyline like i said and it just says rocks the games presents and that's like so that's when all it hits you like oh my god like this is it it's happening you see these beautiful skylines in the city of vice city so i'm looking at this plane but it says it says 919 it says why 69 when you can 9 i 9 i 9 i believe it says so you guys get it you guys get rock stars uh you know what i'm saying their uh their humor and stuff like that but that, that's what it says with the the plane right there you know uh passing by and then you continue on it shows more of the beautiful buildings of vice city and then it goes into it looks like you know kind of like uh it looks like by the keys maybe a lot of these boats are in florida people use and around the world but you know if you're in like like a swampy environment or like you know kind of like me like the everglades i'm not sure if the everglades if, if 
it was going to be in GTA 6. Maybe I heard a while ago. If it was, maybe it's going to be. I'm not sure 100%, but it may be in the keys. But this type of boat is, it's got like that big fan in the back. It's kind of like, like I said, what people use kind of like, like swampy, more environments like that. And in my opinion, it'd be really fun and cool to be able to use one of these and, uh, you know what I'm saying, drive them and explore and all that stuff. So that'd be really, really cool. And it continues on, shows like all these flamingos. Uh, it even shows an alligator here chilling, uh, you know, like different types of animals and just like the, uh, it looks like the Everglades a bit. I'm not gonna lie. It looks like the, uh, you know, it's very swampy and uh, it looks like, you know what I'm saying, we're just like cruising through there on that, in that little boat. I forgot what they call those. Let me know in the comments. But yeah, it's, it's, I was, I was thinking of always the, the boat with the big fan on it. But you know what I'm saying? That's uh, so cool, man such a florida thing too okay so next up we have uh, a beach shot and it just like i said it in the beginning it just shows way more the beach you look further down and just oh my god like the the, the, the how big it is right there just on that this beach shot right here the amount of people you know like it's, it's just insane like you know like compared to gta 5 seeing how many people is here and just like doing all different types of things and all different types of you know obviously like newer updated you know like then npcs out you know how it's out there in gta 5 and here you know what i'm saying this looks like something you see out of a movie man like it's just mind-blowing see a couple planes in the sky you see like two different types of helicopters actually you'll see like one looks like a sea sparrow kind of like the one that goes in the water then it's like another like looks like a like a ems type one you'll see a plane up there as well all right so going on it's gonna be next to a big freight boat with uh you know like looks like maybe a mission maybe it's just cruising you know in our boats there's like three different kinds of boats here and it just shows the beautiful water and the, the you know like how different and how much better it looks just like you know i'm saying just going and just cruising in the water like i said it could be us just cruising or maybe a mission who knows but it just shows more of you know i'm saying the water and see the buildings behind you white city and just it just looks stunning next up we got some you know cars driving on the freeway zooming and we got this girl while i'm out hanging out with her arms all out having fun chilling and some of that that right there too is a cool little new feature you know that you can maybe do and you're riding fast and you pick up a girl and she's enjoying the ride having a good time maybe she'll like stand up like woohoo you know like you got the drop tops chilling oh yo like you know i'm just having a good time but now moving on there's gonna be a this is gonna be more it looks like down like out the outskirts of miami uh that was talked about before so pretty much it's like showcasing the outskirts of vice city so basically like if you guys are everyone to miami down to florida you know that like obviously you got the heart of miami you know what i'm saying the main city then you got like you know they always get the outskirts of big cities and that's where you, things kind of can, can get really dangerous you know what i'm saying but yeah there's like it looks like it's all chilling hanging out here uh you know these really nice vehicles bro there's like these cool eyes in this building and it looks like they're pulling into some kind of you know what it reminds me of it reminds me of too fast too furious when uh you know i think it was his name was tez it's literally Chris to play the character Tez basically he had his own like like uh, his own shop and that's what it kind of reminds me of reminds me maybe of like a, like a, some sort of like Benny's or something like that maybe something like that because you guys see like a low rider type cars pulling up in there so maybe it's some sort of like new Benny's we go to or something like that all right so now we got it looks like this is make it rain mondays a new club or like looks like a strip club they're gonna be able to either attend or possibly own or something like that i'm sure there's gonna be multiple of them not just one because miami aka my city obviously gonna be massive there's gonna be a lot of them not just one in my opinion and moving along so this is one thing that really caught my eye in this whole trailer a lot a lot of things this trailer man is the detail you know of rockstar games they really made this feel like like florida bro like if you're a floridian man you see this trailer you're just you're just gonna laugh because some of these things they have in here is so accurate to a typical floridian bro like like for instance this next thing we see we're looking at is my man's right here with the gold teeth one of the first people that i met when i came down to florida he had gold teeth and so that and you know he's from miami and it's just like a more of a Miami thing. Everyone is watching if you're from Miami, you know what I'm saying? It's like a thing where, you know, a lot of people down in Florida, especially if, like, if you're from Miami, you know what I'm saying, got the gold tee. So that, that caught my eye. That's a really cool thing that Rockstar picked up on. And you know what I'm saying is, and they got to know that type of stuff, which is really cool in my opinion. Like I said, the detail, the detail knowing that's like a Florida, Florida thing of people having like the gold teeth and shit like that and then it goes to probably one of, oh my god i can't pick one of these like my favorite man but this next shot at nighttime is just dude like i, I don't even know what to say like stunning it's not even the word for it man it's just it's insane 
like the with the amount of detail that is showing of you know the whole you know the vice city right here the heart of vice city uh you know and all that it's just uh, crazy it's just like the amount of detail how it looks the clouds the city the lights at night uh, it just looks absolutely mind-blowing and then we're going on it looks like it's just be, like getting dark it just got dark uh, from you know the way uh you know the sky looks and then obviously you know you got the the boardwalk you had down here downtown miami you got people stepping out the cars it looks like a ferrari someone's getting out of you got someone sitting down looks like maybe uh begging for like change something like that you got it looks like a corvette and then you got a Lamborghini, you got a Porsche, all chilling right there. And this is something that you would see in Miami. You go down, you know what I'm saying, like on a weekend type thing in this area. This is something you would see. This ain't like no like, you know, like this is something you would actually see in Miami, you know. And it's just so cool. Like the lights on the hotels and the motel, Dixon and all that. And, you know, all the people walking down the street and this and that. It's just really really miami and really dope then you got the nightclub scene that continues and then it shows it looks to be in my opinion this is what we're going to do for smuggling so it's like a smuggling type looking plane then you see like a cargo ship and you see the florida keys so this is the florida keys and again just mind-blowing how great it looks the water the roads to be able to go to like we're gonna go on the different islands and all that and just like i said just mind-blowing just how it looks you know what i'm saying this looks incredible and the next shot it looks like so at first i didn't realize this but this is actually lucia and oh she looks you know what i'm saying like yeah but i uh, know it's, it's lucia and she's up there maybe like trying to fit in for like some sort of mission or maybe she's just like chilling or somebody you know what i'm saying like why can't you know girl go up there and chill you know and vip like way up there so so what i like about this shot is it's way out, like high up and you get to see a really dope view of the city and how massive the city is you know what i'm saying and what i like about the detail of this about you know how rockstar you know made the game with the engine and all that is obviously the clouds a lot of people point out they're similar to rdr2 which i do agree and is a good thing because rdr2 looks amazing and so does gta 6 obviously but you can see like in the distance it gets kind of like hazy and you know foggy or whatever and you got that and that's how it really looks like in real life you know what i'm saying so like the amount of detail from like looking down from up here even you know is just really really dope then you got the sign that says vice and what's really cool now too is we have this new thing we're going to be able to do it looks like uh, it looks like it's going to be some sort of like maybe life invader app you know we got like everyone's always live on instagram and stuff like that so it looks like some sort of new thing that rockstar has we're going to be able to go live and stuff like that because then this one of them on the boat it says a poppy save some sugar baby for the rest of us uh you know stuff like that and then the most craziest thing i was gonna dying of laughter when i seen this bro this is the most florida thing ever you see this dude pulling a freaking gator out of someone's pool now some may think like oh it's just you know they're doing it because florida gta 6 you know by city but this is actually some stuff that happens on the regular in florida like when there's a like a alligator you know uh in someone's pool it happens all the time like and someone comes out and has to get them out the pool stuff like that like they always end up in people's pools which i thought was hilarious like wow that that detail right there like that is a florida thing that actually happens you know what i'm saying and this looks like to be too like more in the outskirts of the inner city it looks like that you know you can tell by the house and like the backyard and stuff like that you know what i mean and then we got more of the life invader or whatever after this is for uh this girl trying to twerk it with it yo <laughs> uh this, this is someone called the department of transport on this dump truck <laughs> and uh then you see the cars doing i believe it's called uh swinging uh, and uh yeah they're just doing that and you know the racing and car scene is really dope and uh, you know miami and a big thing and you know like it reminds me a lot of too fast too furious when i see like a lot of these like like parts and you know the car scenes stuff like that because of too fast too furious how many times i watch it because it's all in miami and stuff like that so that's what it kind of reminds me of you got some girls chilling you know turning up on the live and then you got an alligator walking into a gas station now this i said on the stream when i was reacting is a little bit over dramatic has it happened yes i'm sure i've never seen it happen of a gator walking inside of a building but i 
I'm pretty sure I might have heard something along the lines that happened before. But, you know, Gators, they, they would do it. It's possible. In, in Florida, it is very possible for this to happen. Like I said, this is another detailed Florida thing. You know what I'm saying? You know, it's not going to be like everyday thing. You see a Gator just walking in through the, the doors of a gas station. But like I said, it's Florida. They're, they're everywhere. And it could happen. Then you see something here of the police breaking into somewhere. I'm not sure, like, what this is exactly for. I obviously won't know until, like, you know, we see more gameplay or something like that. But it looks like they're chasing something. Then you see someone them it continues on looks like to it looks like this is arrow gas station you see a nice truck there and then you see them chasing someone and i said this on stream looks like putter's character hamza uh if you guys don't know putter check him out uh but his rp character one of his rp characters named hamza and it just kind of looks like a um, this big big dude you know so being chased by the police which i find pretty funny and then you see this guy wilding out in the freeway again it shows like this new social media thing that uh you know i'm saying we're gonna be able to use and it looks like on the sciences vice vice beaches port and then there's like another way to go and then this is on the cat and, and this picture is only in leon india is a crotch grab and an apology for bad driving and then you see this other guy it continues on of him hanging out of this uh truck this green truck just wilding out you see this crazy and that's another thing bro that i'm telling you man that you'd only see in florida bro this man out here looks like in a damn g-string or a speed or whatever out here watering his damn grass you know you see a blue pool in the backyard but just yeah this is something you would probably see in florida you know people are pretty weird down here man <laughs> you know what i'm saying so you know it's just then you see the all the you know the the vegetation you know the different types of you know trees and uh, grass which looks you know because i've been in florida myself now for some years and the amount of details everything like that looks amazing and then it looks like there's like a thing where like you know everyone goes to to go mudding I, you know they call it i'm pretty sure they call it mudding you know what i'm saying bring the cars out and just like wall out and have a great ass time now for me uh people i never really went mudding that much but i know it's 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 a thing people do to have fun you know especially in florida it's always sunny it's always you know especially miami you know it's always a thing people can do to go and have fun it's some cool trucks there looks like some new trucks and looks like some sort of event we can maybe attend whenever we want type thing you know participate in stuff like that you know and uh yeah it looks really really dope and then you see like more of like the instagram live or not instagram lives like like life and better lives i'm assuming of like the karen uh you know holding two hammers someone jumping through a table you see a police chase it looks like we i talked about this on stream it looks like the the sign is like teasing like some sort of like I don't know. I thought it was like teasing uh, the vaccine, like one of the vaccine things for COVID or something, but I'm not entirely sure. But there's some do like like depression or something like that, or like like uh, antidepressant or something like that. You see, you see the cop cars as well. You see two different ones. You see like an older model looking one's a sheriff car, and then you see another sheriff. It's a different type of police vehicle. You can tell the colors are different. They're green and white. And in the same shot, you see the two main protagonists. They're in a car. It looks like they just got done robbing somewhere. You can see she's holding money in her hands, Lucia. And if you guys take a look at the detail again, detail, man, this is, is insane. The money looks like kind of like, you know, crumbled up or like, you know, just like grabbed and all, you know, it kind of messed up a little bit. And just that amount of detail like that is just something to me that really stands out that I, you know, you can appreciate. And oh my God, she looks good. And in the trailer, you hear her talking in the background. She says, the only way we get through this is by doing this together. So obviously it's going to be a thing to where we're going to have to do things together as a couple in the game. Because obviously they're a couple, you know, so there's going to be a lot of probably crucial moments where you're going to have to really rely on each other in the game throughout the story to get through, you know, the, you know, the missions and everything like that. And in this next shot, you see, it says no overturning zone. Cops arrest man who flipped his car after peewees dine and dash you can see a cop car right here too it looks like a charger maybe maybe camaro maybe i'm wrong but it looks like yeah it looks like a, a you can see the lights on it and stuff like that cars flipped over stuff like that and then you see someone else too that may be a protagonist it's a guy that uh is locked up he's got like tattoos on his face he's got his uh purple hair stuff like that and then you see in the neighborhood now this is like more outside of you know like i said the outskirts and you see people are on like their dirt bikes and stuff like that and you can kind of see like i said the neighborhood like the houses and how they are 
and stuff like that in like certain parts of the outskirts of Miami. And then it continues on to show like more of them racing, going through cops, uh, you know, like cop chase and stuff like that. And you see another, you know, uh, it shows a little clip. It looks like a Chrysler, if I'm not mistaken, the uh, green car. Uh, this guy, uh, he's probably maybe someone that we like go to meet to race or, you know, participate in like maybe some time, some type of activity. It says high rollers lifestyle. It looks like he's like live or something. Keeps showing this live thing, which I really, really like. It's like an Instagram live, but like for Rockstar, it'd probably be, I said probably like Life Invader. And then you see Lucia and I believe it's Jason inside of a store. It looks like they just robbed. And then you see them pulling out. It says pawn and gun. Uh, pawn and gun stores so obviously they need guns to go do what they gotta do looks like there's like a regular you know what i'm saying like none too crazy car they just got in robbing it and then they peel off and they end up inside it looks like a motel and then she looks at him and she says trust and then he replies back he's like trust while they're laying in bed and then it shows him again like this this is such a cool scene man them busting up inside this gas station together do another robbery and it looks like outside you can't really see too much but it's just like uh like a truck something else and they can just amount of detail you see like all the stickers on the doors and everything like that and they just bust up in here man guns look really realistic and oh my gosh he looks thick <laughs> yeah and um man, it's just, she looks really good and uh you know what i'm saying you go up they go up in there and looks at the robin it then it goes to the gta6 logo saying grand theft auto coming 2025 and i just want to say this man i want to point this out this gt6 logo i cannot wait for this one thing believe it or not, i was looking forward to more than anything because i was so tired of seeing all the fake clickbait logos of all the years so this one literally bro by far is the best one i've seen and it's made by the one and only rockstar games the official gta6 logo now i know a lot of people were disappointed saying it's coming in 2025 but you got to think, man, you got to appreciate Rockstar for what they're doing and not rushing it. Because they could rush it. And if they did, it would turn out a disaster like other games. <clears throat> Saints Row, <clears throat> you know, Cyberpunk at the very beginning. But I'm fine with that. You know, it is what it is. I wish it was coming out sooner. I was hoping fall 2024, but it's all good. It's coming. We've seen what it looks like officially. And I love the whole theme of it. I love everything about what I've seen. I love the whole Miami thing, the whole Florida vibes, the amount of detail, the social media, you know, that, you know, everyone's on social media, live streaming, you know, all that stuff like that. And the amount of detail that they took on this game and all that. And the, the, the storyline, you know, the Bonnie and Clyde type thing with Lucia and Jason of them doing things together, having to trust each other, having, you know, like all that stuff really is going to be a big factor. I feel like obviously as a couple, you have to rely on each other, have to do things together. And I feel like it's just so dope. And I cannot wait to play this. Cannot wait to stream it. Cannot wait to cover content on this. I got way more videos on the way, guys. Stay tuned. I'll make sure to, uh, you know what I'm saying, let you guys know if Rockstar does upload any more trailers because this is called trailer number one. So it will be another one. And then I'm sure there'll be another gameplay trailer they'll release when they're ready. And then, of course, online trailer. So, hey, we got a, way, a little ways to go. You know what I'm saying? But uh, at least we got a trailer. We officially got to see what it looks like. Let me know what you guys think down below. What's your favorite part of this trailer? What do you guys over overall think about the trailer? You guys hype? I cannot wait, man. And, uh, yeah. Also, I just want to mention, I believe for PC, it's not going to be coming out, like, right off right off launch it's gonna be for new generation consoles only ps5 xbox series but yeah with all that being said hope you guys enjoyed stay tuned for the next video or live stream make sure to subscribe for more content of course if you enjoy and all that good stuff hit the video like so more people can see this but yeah hope you guys enjoyed it's been your boy drama have a good one and i'm out peace